I'm Rachel Fetty. I'm the editor on episode three of The Great War. This scene was about the Lost Battalion. They've been stuck in the pocket for a few days now. Things are getting pretty rough. We spent a lot of time looking for imagery that would really convey how difficult that time must have been for those guys so that you could feel like you're really in the thick of it, in the pocket with them. They're surrounded by the Germans. They're running out of ammunition. They have no food, no supplies. One of the challenges was to strike the right balance with the pacing because we wanted you to feel as a viewer that you've been stuck at these guys for a few days and still like the story is moving forward. This one fellow who's lying on his side, I thought was just the perfect shot to convey desperation and loss of hope that those men must have been feeling. And then we start to see some of those dead bodies and wounded men articulating how awful it must have been to be stuck with no idea if help was going to come or not. How hard it must be to still keep an eye out for the next attack that's coming over the edge. So it's building that tension. We're hard to listen to. They're gasping and snuffling. Robert Laplander, the author here, was just such a fantastic interview because he was a total self-made expert on the Lost Battalion and their story. And then we have the German assault. This German footage was actually a real find. Um, it's from a German archive. We were very excited to see these actual explosions. We have this theme of the billowing gas, which was everywhere. And so anywhere we had the chance, we tried to include that visually. I think we hit that balance of feeling that anticipation and also that sort of desperation and waiting.